podcast and YouTube blog covering the German startup scene with news, interviews, and live events. Hello and welcome everybody. This is Joe from Startuprate.io, your startup podcast and YouTube blog from Germany. I'm here at the Frankfurt Book Fair and I do have another startup from the Content Shift Accelerator program here with me. Hi, welcome to Austin. Hello. And you are from the startup? We're from Mindzip. And um, before we talked, you, you told me like Mindzip is something like the Instagram for brilliant ideas. I actually like this phrase, not only since you're based in Frankfurt. So tell us a little bit about this idea. Yeah, Mindzip helps you to remember everything what you have learned. And um, you can make structured study notes uh, while you learn something and uh, later on our system organizes all your notes that you have taken and our study coach uh, optimizes a daily agenda for you and with five minutes of mindset a day you can internalize up to 20 books per year and uh, but you don't need to uh, do all the study notes for yourself you can even subscribe from other people. So we are a community uh, of, we built micro communities of like-minded people uh, around certain questions and uh, books or any source of knowledge. We help you to organize knowledge, your, your key takeaways in an efficient way. Because currently if you save study notes, you can do this in any note-taking app, on paper, in any ebook reader, but what, what is the life cycle of the study notes there? You write them down and most likely you don't look at them again, but we make something meaningful out of it uh, to, to internalize it efficiently and to share with other people. Mm -hmm. So um, you're replacing the notes, the, the post-it notes you write everywhere with the social network where you can share or not share your content in a digital way, right? Yes. That is pretty cool. And I've seen when you, when you showed me the app, it's basically an app on a cell phone before we started with the interview. You showed me you even um, prepare for your startup pitch with this. How, how do you do that? Right. We, we have a special, um, we have various use cases and one use case is to prepare a pitch. You upload your pitch deck in our web editor And then you can add for each slide the text, the, your, your key, key thoughts you want, to, uh, you want to say in the pitch. And we help you to optimize your pitch, the wording. And uh, we, we calculate how long the pitch takes. And uh, you, can, you can train the pitch with the app because it's internalization as well. And uh, on top of that, you can share this in a closed user group with your investors or any other stakeholders. And uh, that's a new way to improve pitches and uh, to share ideas with anybody. That is actually a ve very nice applicable idea for our audience. And um, I have a question. H how is your outlook? What are you planning to do like in the next year or next time? We have a lot of use cases like this uh, specific version for, for startups. But in general, we want to structure knowledge and we want to um, help the world to show different perspectives, how, how books or any source where, where knowledge is saved can be seen. So if three people read a book, they have different ideas about the content in the book. And in our system, we can bring all these together and show the different perspectives. And our users can do this in an easy way to connect single thoughts and uh, make something like, create something like a multi-layer mind map. So our community will create in the near future a new reference system for the world's knowledge. So this will totally change the world of learning and how we discover books because Isn't it interesting to uh, know how many times is a specific quote from Goethe used in what books, in what language? Currently, there's no system where you can see this. This will be a possible with Mindzip, and uh, you, you have many use cases out of that. So we will become something like Wikipedia for compressed knowledge. And 
The biggest challenge was to make it easy because knowledge, this topic, what we are working on is complex and uh, we try to make it as easy as Spotify. You subscribe to sing single thoughts or collections of thoughts and you just repeat and study what's interesting for you, like you listen to playlists in, in Spotify. Mm -hmm. That is pretty good. If you just take one step back, you can see the content shift and um, how did you profit from this accelerator program? How did it help you? What do you achieve with this program? Yeah, first of all, we got in contact with interesting people out of the industry and they pushed us to structure our whole uh, use cases and uh, our user base Uh, in a new way, so we worked. We started working intensively with personas, and we defined one persona. We call them Leonardo. These are people that um, create their own study notes if they if they study something, and because they want to repeat them, because they know they they forget up to 70% percent within the first week, and if they repeat, they have an efficient way to internalize everything. So, and we found out through Content Shift that we have a lot of these Leonardos. Uh, and if they find us, they write us love letters because we solve a significant problem in their life. All the study notes that they have taken before, um, now they get meaningful and they, they get uh, uh, organized in one place. And uh, they understand that if you zip what you have learned, With MindZip, you have a place to unzip it when you need it in real life. And, uh, but the best is you can internalize it quickly. So Content Shift pushed us in this direction. And from our, currently we have 120,000 users uh, around the world. And uh, we identified we have a lot of them. And we now ex focusing on this kind of users because they really appreciate we, what we're doing. Great. Well... Best of luck and thank you very much. Thank you. That's all, folks. Find more news, streams, events, and interviews at www.startuprad.io. Remember, sharing is caring.